Hey guys, what's going on? It is Talk Force TV. Yes, I'm back with another video previewing Friday's Championship opener between Forest and Mill at the City Ground. Obviously, Friday night, I'm quite looking forward to it. Um, I think it will be a difficult game. Obviously, this is the starting prediction show, so obviously, I'm going to try and at least get the Team right, I was trying to much look this pre season because, but it's pre season, so it's the first game of the season. Um, I think Mark Walton has unfortunately has lost Matty Cash and Jamie Ward to um injury. Obviously, Matty Cash out for three months now, Jamie Ward's out for six to eight weeks, so we have got players that are missing, but I think we have got good enough squad. Obviously, Kevin Giles. Looking like he is going to join. Um, obviously, I'm going. I'm going to try and predict this team. Get your comments coming in about what team you think we should be putting out. Um, but I think in goal, Jordan Smith. I think he will be um, number one choice for the time being. Um, it's going to be about four actually for me. Four Friday night's game. Um, I think. Pretty much so, Eric Lee I will be coming back at right back. Um, Centaurs will be Wawel and um, Hobbs with two being left back. Um, pretty much going to explain myself on this. I think um, Lee I, he had a good gold cup and I think he's obviously the first two. I think Darryl Rackett did play well against Burnley. Um, it'd be interesting to see how he does do this. Um, but obviously Darryl Rackett can give us that flexibility on the win. As well, so I will expand on that. Um, centaurs with Royal Hobbs, I think we have got two perfectly good centaurs for that. And with me offering that threat up top with the direct, I think them two will be suited a lot more. If not, Mansion can fill in and be that sweeper with Hobbsy being more of a attacking aerial threat. Troy obviously had a brilliant pre season, and I think Troy does differ a lot of that attacking full back like direct and the I do. Um, midfield, I think he will be playing more of a 4 2 3 1. I think, obviously, I've been adamant that he does like his number 10 in there. I think, obviously, it's pretty much says it all my two centre midfielders. I think it will be 4 and Cohen, obviously, the first choice, and we're a lot so much better balance and a lot more attacking threat with them two in there and holding it. Um, I think them two understand Mark Wolverton's philosophy on how to play. And I think it will be quite good. Get your comments coming in about it. Um, I think the Windows, I think it will be Darryl Racker on one win. I think it will offer us that attack and threat down that win like Leah does. Um, I think left and I think it will be Osborne, especially with the injuries about that minute. I don't think Carroll will be fully match fit for Friday that game. And I think Osborne will just give us that width. I think in that number 10 role, I think... It will be um, Zach Clough, I think. Obviously, he is making that number 10 more his own. I think um, it will just give Ziff that a lot more. And up front, it will be Belton. Um, only reason I say Belton is, especially with um, Mill's height, especially if um, Belton get on his feet and actually get running at them, won't be able to actually um, cope with it. I think... Um, with Belton, he gives us that lot more mobility up front than probably like Murphy and Pelias. I think Belton will be able to run at them. Um, obviously, they could change it and pay, not pay down where I can point bench with Belton, Murphy and Osborne. But it depends how Mark Wolverton does actually go about attacking through. We do, we do have a lot more flexibility and, and options up front, which is quite good. Um, like to hear what you think, so do get commenting in the live chat and comments, and we'll be um, getting back to you on this. And um, thank you for watching Talk Forest TV. Please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel as per usual. Um, thank you very much for your support as per usual. Um, thank you and goodbye.